Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through how to create a simple Java application on Ubuntu, package it into a jar file, and run it. We'll cover the following steps. 1. Install Java Development Kit, JDK. 2. Set up a simple Java project. 3. Compile the Java code. 4. Package the application into a jar file. 5. Run the jar file. Hashtag 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 step 1, install Java Development Kit, JDK. First, you need to install the JDK. Open your terminal and run the following commands. You can verify the installation by checking the Java version. Hashtag 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 step 2, set up a simple Java project. Create a new directory for your Java project. Inside this directory, create a new Java file. For example, create a file named hello world.java. Add the following code to hello world.java. Save and exit, in nano, press Ctrl plus X, then Y, and enter. Hashtag 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 step 3, compile the Java code. You can compile the Java code using the javac command. This will create a file named hello world.class in the same directory, which contains the bytecode. Hashtag 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 step 4, package the application into a jar file. To create a jar file, you will first need to create a manifest file. Create a file named manifest.txt. Add the following content to it. Make sure to finish the last line with a new line character. Now, you can create the jar file using the jar command. This command creates a jar file named hello world.jar that includes the manifest file and the compiled class. Hashtag 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 step 5, run the jar file. You can run the jar file using the java jar command. You should see the output. Hashtag 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 conclusion. You have successfully created a simple Java application, compiled it, packaged it into a JAR file, and run it on Ubuntu. You can now expand on this basic structure to create more complex applications. Hashtag 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 additional notes. If you want to add more classes to your project, you can do so by creating additional .java files and compiling them the same way. For more complex projects, consider using build tools like Maven or Gradle. Always ensure that your Java source files are in the appropriate package structure if you are using packages. Feel free to ask if you have any questions or need further assistance.